Alrighty, just going to do a demo on voice typing. So on the right, you should see the Google Docs ed Editor's Help, which um, just briefly talks about punctuation and how to get it to work. On the left, I have a Google document ready to roll, and um, I have it at 18 font, so hopefully you can see it. So let me get this going here. Uh, let's see, make sure you can still see it. Give me one more second. There you go. All right, and so to do voice typing, first you have to go to Tools in your Google Docs and find um, voice typing, or you can hit the shortcut. So now that I have it, notice it's black, so I have to click this to start speaking. And so when I do that, when I say these, these terms right here, um, it will hopefully work when I'm voice typing. So let me get this over here a little bit. All right, so it should be voice typing now, period, new line. Now what if I want to use a different form of punctuation, question mark, new line. Maybe I want to add a little emphasis, exclamation mark, new paragraph. Now this is the tough one. Because when I say the term, it inputs the punctuation. And sometimes I just want to say the term. So this one is a, um, not a perfect one yet. So now that I have this super ongoing long sentence, comma, I'll just go ahead and end it, period. Okay, so those punctuations work pretty good, but the comma one, I have found that if I want to use the term comma in a sentence, I have to spell it out, but then it leaves spaces in between, so watch. New paragraph. If I want to use the term comma, it actually puts in the punctuation, not the word, period. If I try to spell it out, C-O-M-M-A, it leaves spaces between the letters, which doesn't work either, period. So that's the only one I think that I found out of these common punctuations that does not work, period. New paragraph. Give it a try. I kind of like voice typing. I think if you talk to yourself a lot, which I do not normally, period, backspace, comma, it will work great for you, period.